Other news today, it was a heartbreaking tale. A young woman battling both leukemia and pancreatic cancer. The cops say she wasn't sick at all. They say she was faking it to rake in thousands of dollars in donations. I want people to live. I want to live. You know, I want I want there to be a cure. That's Maddie Russo, a 19 year old college student speaking about suffering from cancer. They found a mass on my pancreas and I had stage two pancreatic cancer at just 19 years old. She documented her treatment in a series of heartbreaking social media posts. Before I even started chemo, I harvested my eggs with the OBGYN. Um, and basically it's just to, you're kind of like freezing your eggs. She not only claimed to have pancreatic cancer, but leukemia and a tumor on her spine the size of a football. She raised over $37,000 on a GoFundMe page. Lewis Frillman was so moved by her plight, he donated $1,000. What struck a chord with you about her story? She was a, you know, a very young person that appeared to be in a serious amount of trouble. And your heart went out to her. She was totally believable. But police in Iowa have arrested her, calling it an elaborate scam. The alleged scam was first spotted by doctors who wondered about this image that supposedly showed her getting chemo. It's not the way a medical port should look. The telltale giveaways, it's not sterile and it's not secured with medical tape. Look, this is a real medical port used for cancer patients. It's easy to see the difference. I spoke with cancer patient Anna Cower Kovetsky. Yeah, so the chest port is actually like a like a little port uh, under my skin. It was uh, inserted by a surgery. Does it break your heart that someone would fake having this illness? Absolutely. Well, GoFundMe says they have zero tolerance for misuse of their platform, and they say all of those donations have been refunded.